Hey, what's up? This is your girl, Vakisha Lynn, and I'm a reporter now. And I'm standing here with Corey Calvert, and he is from Chicago, and he is a comedian. And we're standing outside Kryptonite Bar, where he is about to perform. And usually I do these after performance, but I already know he's funny. Right, right, right. I'm All right. Good. We've worked together before. <laughs> That's right. I already know he's funny. So, when did you become a comedian? It was uh, 2008, and I remember it was uh, September. I took a writing class. Okay. I took a writing class at Improv in Chicago. All right, that's what's up. And what do you love about comedy? Turning people around. Some people can walk in a room and have a bad day, and me getting on stage can turn the entire day around. That's move, true. The rest of their week could be good. You don't know what people are dealing with when they come in there, but the laughter that they enjoy when they leave, it's great, you know, it's great, great feeling. You know that somebody happy after seeing me. <laughs> Narcissism? That's what's up. Okay, and where do you do comedy? Just in the Midwest, or have you been? Have you branched out? I have been to L.A. I did a lot of shows in L.A. I even did Oakland, you know, but I haven't been out of town in quite some while, but I'm trying to get myself back in there, so y'all, you know, check your boy out. That's out what's here. up. And where do you see yourself in five years? In five years? Yeah. Somewhere probably on TMZ for getting pulled over in a Lamborghini drunk. That's probably when he had five years. Yeah, yeah. yeah on Hollywood that Justin Boulevard. Bieber shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, just, like the fact that he was able to do that. You know how much money that guy gets? Like that's where I'm trying to be at. That's where I want to be at. I want to be on TMZ with a mug shot, Corey Calvert drunk somewhere out in public, you know, oh. and an expensive car that they towing away somewhere, and I'm getting out. And the you're next not even morning. worried about no, it. Not at all. Not, not even at all. Worried I got about two it. of them. You know what I mean? Right. I got two of them. I'm not even worried about it. I didn't even like that when it was yellow. You know? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm a professional. Let me get it together. <laughs> All right. So, fuck you. I'm sorry. My bad. <laughs> we out here having a good time. It's good. I've never really done an interview like that, you know. And we out here in Rockford. Y'all ever been to Rockford? It's a pretty interesting place. But I was telling Vicky, you know, she say Roseanne wasn't made here. But I said, what does it look like? It had it to have been made it. right here. If you have not been to Rockford, just take a swing by. I ain't say stay. Just go on swing through. <laughs> Keep it a moving. If Matt Drumke going... always say, like, you do know there's a way to get out of here, right? All right. Because <laughs> as a matter of fact, a dude just told me, he asked me, could he buy a cigarette? Then he didn't give me no money. And I was like, that was interesting. But I was like, I'm going to let it slide, though. I don't know what the economy's like out here in Rockford. But then he was like, I hate this town. And I was like, well, won't you ride your bike the hell on up out here? Like, it's not like they keeping you. Like, <laughs> you seem free to roam. Get out of here, like. He riding around Rockford talking about I hate Rockford. Get the fuck out of here, bro. It does. There is other shit outside of Rockford, people. We made the uh, Forbes three most miserable cities. Uh, top three. We were three. Most miserable. Most miserable cities. Yeah, that's because I moved away, though. Rockford would be a happy place if I, I continue to stay here. Stories tall because <laughs> they don't want nobody to jump. <laughs> <laughs> that's horrible. Okay. That's horrible. So if you want to plug anything you got coming up that's not in the next two days because I'm a procrastinator and stuff. Okay, okay. By all okay. means, do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. The Riddles Comedy Club, 111th and Cicero. I will be there all of June. Except for June 7th, I'll be in Michigan City. But you come through Riddles Comedy Club the entire month. He I've got the car like Phil you know Collins and shit. Follow me shit. on Twitter at, at Corey K. Cow. Just the way it sounds, add the E in my name, C-O-R-E-Y, because I heard the girls spell it differently and stuff. It's weird, but even though I'm not a girl, I hope they don't do that. But like, Corey K. Cow, C-O-R-E-Y, K. Cow, C-A-L. That's Twitter and Instagram. And Facebook is just Corey Cow. This is like the longest interview I think I've ever done. I mean, we was giggling the most of it. Like, <laughs> it's not like we just, you know, That's true, because you're you know, funny and, and stuff. And it's not like we ran out of tape. It ain't like you got to pay extra minutes on your phone for recording it. <laughs> All right, that's your girl, Vakisha Lynn. And I'm here with Corey Calvert. Y'all, please check him out. He is really, really hilarious. All right? Say that. Have a good time, y'all. Peace.